to approach the lower lectern for the Foundation's report. Thank you, Madam Speaker. On behalf of our Board of Directors, I want to thank this House for its support for our AMA's charitable arm, the Foundation. While we've got seven weeks to go, 2018 has been another fantastic year for our Foundation. As part of our community health program, we now have seven health organizations throughout the country that are working with and supporting type 2 diabetes and hypertensive patients. We recognized 27 medical students this year with $10,000 scholarships as part of our Physicians of Tomorrow program. And in September, we welcomed our first group into the Physician Development Leadership Program. These future leaders spent two and a half days learning more about our AMA, developing their skills in communications and presentations, and enhancing their, um, their relationships with others and networking. These will be lifetime experiences for them. Their year will culminate in June when they will be attending our house and their respective mentors will be with them during that time. All of their mentors are in this house. I trust you, like me, are extremely proud of the charitable work of our AMA Foundation and believe in our tagline, give back, pay it forward. I suspect we can all remember a moment in time or a person who truly affected our lives. When I was in medical school, I was fortunate enough to receive a scholarship that was from an organization that recognized both my potential and my hard work. This chance gave me a chance to succeed and has stayed with me these years. And as president of the foundation, I want to pay it forward, uh, to give it back, pay back to for what I was given. And I have created a new Student of Tomorrow scholarship for this next year. It will be honoring my family and providing financial support for a student who's like so many of us, needed someone to invest in their future. Thank you. I also want to take this opportunity to introduce one of our 2018 Excellence in Medicine Award winners, Dr. Tina Shaw, the recipient of the Dr. Edmund and Rima Kababi Dedication to the Profession Award. She's an outstanding example of what it means to pay it forward. Tina, can you stand? Thank you, Dr. Shaw, and thank you to each of you in this room who has paid back and paid it forward in so many ways, particularly with your time and your financial resources. If you have not already done so, please stop by the booth for the Foundation and look at our amazing programs and also look into the Upgrade to Upgrade incentive. If you have donated more to the foundation in 2018 compared to 2017, you will be entered into a drawing for an upgraded airfare to one of the House of Delegate meetings next year. Also ask about our limited edition blue crab pins for the foundation this year. Thank you again for your dedication to our support of our programs and sharing in our mission to bring together physicians and communities to improve the nation's health. Thank you.